Still there. Come on, go, my little girl. I'll be fine. Are you sure? Very sure. Come on. You worry too much. Go, go. Take go. a rest. Go. I'll be fine. I'll be back. his face. But he was getting better. And he's still getting better. How is he? Could have been better, but he will get okay. Don't worry about that. We have never seen him this sick. I understand, but he's a human being. He could get sick. It's normal. If he wasn't okay or wouldn't get better, do you think I would have danced up my life coming to you people to come and hug him? Imagine that now. I wouldn't have been this happy. It's because he'll be okay. Trust me. Please, you won't believe it when I told him you were coming and I called you on the phone. Come and see happiness on his face. <laughs> so, you can imagine him now looking at you and seeing this sadness all, all over your faces. No, 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 you have to cut it out. Hmm? Can I see those smiles? Good. So let's go and see. Come on. Okay, Come on, let's see. go see. Okay. Let's go. Come on. How are you? Oh, well. 
I'm a lot better than I was yesterday. Um, Daddy, we were thinking, why don't you go back abroad for your medication? No, 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 not that. Not that. I mean, they have tried. One year, six months in that hospital abroad. I think it's just a little too much for me. And besides, Dr. Wale is good. He was here yesterday. <coughs> Sorry. Yeah. Sorry, Daddy. Uh, yeah. Was he suggested you going back? No. <laughs> but if he does, he will stop being my doctor. C come on, Daddy. Okay, okay. Now maybe he will not be sacked immediately. But three days after. <laughs> Oh, Daddy, I miss how funny you can be. You see? Th that's why I need to be here to be your personal comedian. <laughs> you have to. You just have to. <laughs> and besides, my wife takes very good care of me. And I'm a lot better. Yeah. Mm -hmm. She sure does. Mm -hmm. Auntie Susan is amazing. Oh, yes. You can say that again. She is. <laughs> she is. Um, Daddy? Yes, dear? What do you say? If we go right into the kitchen and make you a meal. Ooh. And I would say, what are you two beautiful ladies still doing here? <laughs> All right. Good delicacy coming right up. Mm -hmm. So get thyself ready for some trail. Oh, <laughs> hurry up, my children. I am craving for some flavor, some meals. This man, you know you're stubborn, right? Please, this is the last time. You promise? I promise. All right, I'm going to keep it right here for you. So Auntie Susan doesn't see it. That's my girl. <laughs> <Yes>. <laughs> okay, that's okay. Thank you. 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 What's happen now? Huh? I was trying to gather some information before I can call. Ah, that guy's been calling all day. Oh. He's been blowing my phone up. So what are we going to do? We have to confront him and tell him the truth. You know? Do you know how stupid the truth sounds? The truth is that we are duped now. It's the simple truth. We have to tell him. Even if we tell him the truth, do you think he will believe us? I don't know, even if he doesn't believe us, like, that's the only story to tell. What else are we going to tell him? Do you get me? Like, we have to tell him. Look, we have to sound like we are going to be able to pay him his money as fast as possible. <laughs> as fast as possible. We're going to fight 35 million naira as fast as possible. Yeah. Huh? Honestly, yeah, you know, even though that we had to convert the money to dollars, I mean, that's what made it get up to 35 million. If not, where will forget the mind to ask for that kind of money? Bro, he's calling again. Bro. He's calling again. He's been calling like every five seconds. Bro, that bad, bro. Pick it. Hello. Hello, sir. Uh, yes. He's here. Okay. Hey, Silo. Big brother. Yeah, I greet you. No, 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 bro. Heaven knows that we never plan to dupe you. I swear. No, no, now me carry this deal, come. It's my deal. Yes. I know how I had to talk to Felix to to, to come on board. Yeah, so everything is on me, bro. It's on nah, me. Why are you talking that kind of Why are you saying that? Just put it on me, bro. No, look, this guy in the US, now my guy, yo, we even stayed together back in school. Yeah, so now, brother, I, I take a look this whole thing before I give him the money. Bro, before I converted this money and gave it to him, I went to his family house. 
I even sat down with his mom. The guy has been ghosting me. He's been ghosting me, bro. I have gone. I've gone back to the house, but everybody don't jackpa. Bro, I know say no be no be no be small money. But look, I promise you on God, bro, on God, we are going to pay you back this money. We'll do everything we can to pay you the money. Yes, everything we can. Yes, 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 yes. We'll, we'll do anything you want us to do. You'll do anything. And you're including me in the anything. What do you, do you know what yes, anything will be? Yes, he's, he's the one talking. I'm the one okay. talking. Hello, sir. Hi, sir. Um, no, 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 sir. I'm, I'm, I'm fully involved in, in this, you know. So it's not just him; it's, it's me too, you know. And no, there's no, sir. How are we going to run away from the country now? You know where we live. You know where our families live. We'll never do that. Please, just give us time to come up with a payment plan to, to refund you. Eh? We'll try our best to do that. Okay? Please. No, 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 no. There's no need to involve the police. That's not, that's not necessary right now. Please, sir. please, please, please. Just give us time. Okay? All right. Yeah. Oh, yeah. We'll, uh, we'll wait for you. We'll, we'll be waiting for you, sir. We'll be waiting to hear from you. Okay. B bye. What did he say? He said he would tell us what to do. What is that going to be? Any idea? I don't know. As long as it's not to keep somebody or to sleep in a cell. Oh my god. You're saying anything, anything. What if you say go and kill somebody for me now? You, you can't kill. Understand, man. understand, I've never felt like this in my entire life. And that's why you're saying that they should put everything on you. Huh? They should put the blame on you. Don't be me carry this deal, come. Don't be me ginger this deal. Don't be me encourage you. Who encourage you? Huh? You're a farming good guy now. Good guy, good guy. We are fine. We are trying to get out of problems, and you're trying to put yourself in it, guy. That's not a smart move. Bro. They're mad. When when have you known me to run away from a challenge? Eh? Me, Felix One of Africa. When have I ever run away from a challenge? I look it in the eyes and I step to it. I face it. Do you get me? Eh? And if the tables were turned, you do the same thing. I, at least I hope. You know? Yeah, I will. I will. I'll show you be my guy. Thanks, man. I appreciate it. No, all of We're in this together, you know. We'll get out of it together. But this guy will use our IC shake it, I swear down. Where are we going to see if that's 5 million, bro? Bro. I say in installments. Maybe have 5, 5, 5, 5k installments. So. You really talk 5k? Where, where, where the 5k day? Ah, we think they do 5k. When one, like, I do 5k, you do 5k. We do, we do it weekly. 10, 10k, weekly. Uh -huh, 10k times what's to 35 million? 35 million. How many years will you spend on my silo? We wait. I guy won't wait to. Hmm. All those are passed, yeah, right? mess us up, man. This guy will mess us up. So, Daddy, we are still waiting. What do you think? Mm, just give me a minute. <laughs> How long? How long? How long? What's happening? Just <clears throat> give me one second. I'll tell you what I think. Oh. Okay. Mm. That'd be so nice. Thank you, Auntie. It is nice. nice. Thank you. You can pay us to take over your kitchen. Mm -hmm. Never. <laughs> Nobody outcooks my wife. <laughs> my wife is the best. Mm. Whose wife is it? Mm. I don't want to take over anyone's kitchen, okay? I did this one out of goodwill. I don't <laughs> enjoy cooking. See what I'm saying? You cannot outcook my kitchen. wife. Mm -hmm. You cannot. <laughs> She's the best. Nice. No, I agree with you. Daddy? I know that everyone is expecting us to prove that you didn't make a mistake handing over the company to us. Which? Who is everybody? No, no, no. Look, let me tell you. The only people that are important to me are those of us who are on the table here. Mm. All those people out there are inconsequential. What I expect of you is make yourselves proud, make me proud, make your late mom proud, and of course, Make your stepmother proud. But the truth is, I I'm handing over the complaint to you because I know what you can do. Not because I don't have a choice. Yeah, I trust you. I won't disappoint you. Daddy. I know that. Mm. <laughs> Thank you, Daddy. Oh. And you guys are doing great. Aww, really. Thank you. I'm yes. so proud of both of you. Thank you said you are doing great. Very very great. With three masters degree. And a PhD? Do you think I'm going to doubt my girl? 
How can you? How can you go? Doc, how you doing? Doctor. Don't call me doc. Doctor in the house. <laughs> Imagine this something everybody is fighting for, working so hard to get. Bro, what's it? Hmm? You've been hissing since. Bro, no, I've been thinking about this, man. How can a full grown man like you, like me, dupe us of that huge amount of money? Like, are we kids? How can that happen? How can that happen, bro? We've been slacking, you know, honestly. Doesn't even make sense to me. Like, a whole me. Someone will dupe me like, 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 like I'm a JJC. I've been thinking about this. Like, that's like taking candy from a child. Are we children? Um, bro, you be child? Hmm. Answer me, bro. Are you a child? I've been thinking about this thing myself, too. Right? I've been thinking about it from every possible angle. Like, is there something I saw but ignored or something? Bro, we have to get that guy. We have to get that guy. We have to get that guy. Anyhow, we have to get that guy. You can't just take this thing and go, bro. It's, it's, it's so, somehow, it's respect to our manhood, though. We have to get that guy. Okay, so how do you suggest we do that? We get somebody that lives in San Francisco. He's in San Francisco, have you? We get somebody that lives in San Francisco to track him down. Simple, straight, you know? We can't just let him go like that, so... Ah. What if he does not live in San Francisco? I mean, is it already obvious that everything he told us is a lie? We have to do something, bro. We can't just be pessimistic. We have to be proactive. We have to act. We can't just wait for things to happen to us. We have to go out there and get it, bro. And Silo now will come and tell us something that we can't do. That's impossible. Or, or jail time. Do you want to go to jail? Hmm? You're doing fine boy, fine boy. You go to jail in this country. Honestly, my brother. Bro, that's like my biggest fear. <laughs> jail in this country. You know, I just, I just wish I have like a rich girlfriend or something. You know, sometimes you come from a different angle that I don't understand your reasoning. What? Which rich girlfriend will give you 35 million? I'm not saying she should give it to me like dash me. I'm saying like, give it to me as a loan that I'll pay back. So you think these rich kids have that kind of money at their disposal? Yes, no. Oh my guy, you're, you're, you're living a dream. Do you understand? Imagination. See, big cars, big house, expensive schools, expensive stuff, trips abroad. That's it. Five like this. Don't finish. Shake it out. That's it. I'm telling you. Nobody's giving you 35 million for free. And well, even if they don't have, at least their dad do. Now, it's so easy now. No, no, it's so easy. Everybody that's walking around on the streets will just meet them. Hey, let me see your dad. Okay, see my dad. Hey, the dad will see you. Take four billion. Start business. Don't even pay back. Take. That's how life is. If wishes were horses, beggars will ride. That's why we have horse here. I just have to think. I just have to see Sometimes you're thinking left, something that's not thinking, that's not thinking well. You're not thinking well sometimes. And you're blaming me. I'm not blaming oh, well, I mean, well. It's not look, my head, like I said, is full. I've not been in this situation before now. I swear, man, this. But then you know. Okay, let's try your suggestion. Maybe we should look for someone that stays in San Francisco. That's what I'm saying. It doesn't even have to be San Francisco, go, 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 go. It can be Stockton, it can be uh, San Jose, all of them in that North California. It's not like they're coming from far, like from New York or something. Even if it's New York, do you know, do you know anybody in New York? You know? Oh Anywhere in America, bro, even if it's Mexico, they can cross over, bro. I'm telling you, man, let me even check my phone. This guy cannot take this money and we're here sitting around in the AC. Like, we didn't just lose 35 million. That's somebody's coming for our next. Bro, that's mad. 35 million. Oh, he's mad, Abby. I believe so. I believe he's mad. Do you know what would be madder? When you're in jail serving 50 years for stealing somebody's ah, money. Come on now. I hope you'll be saying, oh, that's now? mad. Ah. You're not even you're not feeling this thing, no. Okay, it's okay, okay. Let's just just try. I get you. Okay.
love coming home. It's me too. You know there's nothing permanent in this life. Why do you say that? Dad, I mean, I remember how agile you used to be. Yeah. After mom's death, his sickness just got worse. But he was ready with Auntie Susan by the time he got sick. She's not the person he grew with and built with. True, and loved helplessly. Love like that is irreplaceable. But Auntie Susan is cool. Very. Always smiling. And protective of that. Ah, that is lucky. Mm -hmm. You know, most people don't get to get it right with love twice in one lifetime. Fact. <sighs> Nora, yes? can you be Auntie Susan to any man? I don't get your question. What do you mean by that? Well, that's the only way I can copy what is in my head. What do you mean by can I be into Susan to any man? Okay. Can you marry a widower with grown kids and not be able to have your own children? I don't think Auntie Susan marrying a widower with grown kids is the reason she doesn't have her own children. Maybe she has gotten into menopause. It's a lie. She is 53. And she's been married to dad for six years now. Mm -hmm. That means she got married to him at the age of uh, 47. Huh. You're actually right. You know some women eat menopause as early as 40. You know what? I think... I'm going to ask her if she, you know, ever misses having her own children. I don't think she would like such a personal question, Nora. Well, I think that depends on how I present it. But if I notice it, she's uncomfortable. I'll let it be. Better. Left to me, I would say, leave such personal questions. It's sensitive. Hmm. How are you, my babies? Good morning, Annie. Susan. Did you girls sleep well? Yes, I did. No, Good. not really. What do you mean by not, not really? I slept off in Nora's room and she did not wake me up. Mm. Sorry, I thought you were comfortable. No, you could have woken up. <laughs> Sorry, no. Thank you, Auntie yeah. Susan. Is that away? No, no, not yet. Still okay. sleeping. So what are we cooking, Auntie Susan? I'm making greens for that. That's what he said he wants to eat when he wakes up. Oh, so he pre-orders his meal before he wakes. Yes. Before <laughs> That's on <laughs> boss move. <laughs> can say that they <laughs> Meanwhile, we have cereal, bread, eggs in the fridge. Make yourself some breakfast. Nah, no we don't do breakfast. I'll just have a cup of coffee later. Is that um, true? Yep. Well, I think I'll do zero. Um, oh, my God. It's children. And Susan. Yes. Can I ask you a question? Go ahead. Do you... Do you miss having children? Wow, seriously. I can't just ask someone that now. No rap. Don't worry. It's a very innocent question. Sure? Also, why not? I'm free to talk about anything. Yes, I do. Sometimes. Please adopt me. Mm. Adopt me. 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 Adopt Oh, so I don't know how it's going to be. Oh, um, I'm sorry. Why should you be sorry? It's, it's a natural thing. Everyone knows that it will come sometime. So 
Meanwhile, I'm still not missing anything. I have my two angels. Oh. <laughs> and I love you guys so much. I love you too. Nora, hurry up. Oh. <laughs> and it is not a joke. <laughs> You are approaching men of poor. It is you that is approaching men of poor. It is you that is approaching men of poor. You didn't hear what she said. When are you getting married? Okay. She's telling you the right thing. The thing is not a joke. It's not a joke. Okay, you can see her again. Okay, let's see. That must be Hilda and Dyson. Oh, wow. It's been a while I saw them. Let me get them. Tell them I'll soon be the best one. Let me quickly do this for your dad. Mm -hmm. Alright. You take care of my husband. <laughs> Get married. Yeah, I take care of my husband. Oh, I will. I will. I can't wait. I find the right person. <laughs> Ooh, that would be nice. Mm. Um, I say I think this is enough. Yeah. yeah. See my ladies. Bad <laughs> guy. Right. Take it easy with me. Look, this mm -hmm. is, I, I just have something little to, to, to share with you. Well, uh, also, no. I said it. No, no, no. You can never come without a basu. Okay. I know you well. Who have you killed? Come on, nobody. Who are you about to kill? Nobody. Did you stab somebody? Man, stop this. Man. What did you steal from? Nothing. If I don't trust you. Come on, man. But for this one, trust me for Ajano. once. Okay, what is it? Look, what I have to tell you, I, I don't want everybody hearing what I, I want to say, so can we go outside, please? Mm -hmm. Hold on, also go. Say it. Wait, 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 wait. Just, just. Hey, whatever you want to say, be quick about it too. You know, I was cooking when you came. And also, so far, I'm going to have to I'm going to catch you. Oh, you're going to Let's go. What are you sitting down here now? Come on, put me out this matter. Out. My friend, get up. Uh, mm -mm. My friend, be a brother super here now. No crazy. Okay. My dear, when I'm still cooking at you. The pot was beginning to burn. I'm hungry. I think I may just take cereal. <laughs> Maybe it's the age thing. <laughs> Your body is probably trying to eat up for the babies before menopause hits. <laughs> So, because I'm older than you by two years, if you think it's so much car, sis, it's a lot. Hey, don't even bother. I'm planning on getting pregnant. There are many volunteers now. Mm -mm, I don't want that. I want to fall in love, get married, get pregnant in that order. Well, me too, but I'm not in a hurry. I am. I understand. <laughs> you're going to get it from me. Do you know that? Do you know that? This girl, you're trying me. Okay, just continue. Susan, is everything okay? Is it not this person? That guy is just a pain in my brain. Does he have any issue? If you ask him, what else? He has this problem that he wants to solve. He doesn't know how to solve it. You know. On and on and on. So but this time around, I don't care. And I know it's money again. It's always money with him. Anyway, what were you guys talking about that you were laughing? <laughs> Let me join you and laugh right to her. So, what any problem? Nora here wants to fall in love. Mm, As if wow. I am the only one that wants to fall in love. <laughs> Falling in love is not bad. Mm -hmm. Everyone ah. should fall in love. Yes, yeah. Lily. Don't mind her. Yeah. Um. 
Aunt Susan, uh -huh. my inquisitive How daughter. did you and my dad fall in love? No, Ra! Why do you like asking weird questions? Because allow me, uh -huh. allow me to answer my question. The question is mine. We went for a golf present, Lagos. Mm -hmm. And your dad, as usual, was the chief speaker. When they called him to speak, come and see the way he was speaking. Everybody was just watching. Everybody. I was so proud, even not knowing him, I was still very proud. So I was looking like other people. When they finished, we went for a section in another uh, boardroom. We went for a section. So people were going to congratulate him, say hello to him. I decided to join mother so let me go and say hello to the original chief speaker. Mm -hmm. As I was going, God said, push it. This person will push it. This person will ah, I'll give him a ring. I said, well, I tried again. The same thing. Oh, I just left. Ah. If it's me, I'm not going to agree. All of us will get there together. Unfortunately, guess what? 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 See him walking towards me. Ooh. You know you have to pray. When you know deep inside, this is what you did praying for. And I said, I was like, Sammy, I need to be with you. Can you let him be this place? This man is coming to me. He said, Hello, I saw you coming to say hello to me. And you walked back. What happened? And you can imagine. Mm -hmm. The rest is history. Uh, <laughs> that sounds like a perfect romantic story. That's the kind of romantic story that I want. For myself. I will. <laughs> well, I will. well <laughs> not every love story is that simple. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Some are quite complex. <laughs> but whether complex or simple, love is love. Love is love. love. I hear you, true. <laughs> so we wait, you know, till tonight. He calls and he tells us what's up, you know? Yeah. Sleep in jail, we go, we go nah, nah, nah. I don't think he's going to involve the police, bro. Why? Have you ever thought where he got the money from? How he got the money? You know? Ah, come on, guy. You, we both know police these days don't really care about that. As long as you're giving them some money, they're cool. Yeah, I still don't think he's going to involve them. You know, because if he was, we would be picked up already. You know? Well, me, I just wish I knew this whole thing was going to go south. I wouldn't have been involved at all. Bro, we are gone past that, okay? We are gone way past that. Just leave that talk. Um, you know what, I beg, please help me um, stop by that place where we usually get food. Uh, Don't really catch me. Uh, bro, I'm sick of that place, bro. I'm sick of that place, I'm telling you. And tomorrow we'll just find another place, bro. Ah. As if they don't pick us this night, they're talking of tomorrow. Nobody's picked. Ah. Why are you talking like this? <laughs> I better get prepared, though. You know, you should. You're bringing bad karma, bro. Don't talk about it, bro. It's not happening. Yeah, it's not bad karma. Me, I'm just saying that you should. Nobody's get... picking us up, okay? We we'll, we'll wait for him to call and then we we'll know what's up. Like I said, let's just get used to eating bad food because prison food is never nice. <laughs> Lily, stop saying that you don't want to be fully involved. But you can handle it. Mm. I'm not going to handle it. It was given to both of us to handle. So we'll both be end this together. You can be assistant managing director. But well, that one is without an assistant managing director. He was given to both of us and we have to do everything within our means to make sure that that business survives. Mm. I was thinking about reviving mom's art gallery and managing that one. That's actually a good idea. You know, and to make dad happy. And we have enough money to get it going. True. So, when we do two or three highly publicized art events, then art lovers will take over from us. And we not only sell artworks, we also rent the space for events and shows. Mm, that's amazing. Mm -hmm. And also, we'll have a restaurant in the space. Mm -mm. No, that's a copy. I've seen someone do that. No, it's not. Exactly the same as is out of necessity. You know, in the whole of that area, there are no restaurants there. And if we want to attract people to use our space for all sorts of events, we have to make it comfortable for them. Do you know what it's going to take to manage an art studio, a gallery, and then own a restaurant? 
but we don't have to own it directly. We can rent this space to other franchise. Well, I think that's good. Mm -hmm. So I'm thinking if we diversify this business to make it more profitable, so we can start immediately, you know, checking out restaurants until we find one that serves what we think we are looking for, and then we'll discuss with them. When can we start? Tomorrow. Okay. You know, thinking about it now, I think that space is actually so small. The space beside it is ours, so we can break down the walls and rent the space. How long have you been thinking about this? For weeks. Obviously. <laughs> so do you think we should talk to that about it? Mm, yes, even though he said we should handle it together. Yeah, let's still have a seat down with him, even if it's just this one time. Yeah. We must make this generational world that is in the sheet and happen. And we should have a unique handshake whenever we sell a baddest meeting like this. <laughs> because we are cop members, right? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> handshake. Let's one side learning. Let's okay. try. Let's okay. Try. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Something like that. <laughs> Still wants us to do this. And today. That's crazy. Wow. So what are we going to do? Uh, I mean, we're not in a relationship. You know, that's one. Does not mean I'm looking to get into one. I'm looking to get into one. I mean, loneliness is not before my kind, though. I'm telling you, man. All I'm trying to say is that we'll escape all that you broke my heart, you broke my soul kind of talk. Did you get me? Well, me, I'm not leaving this house. No matter how cool you try to make this scene. You're not leaving this house? You don't have any choice now. Food no day the house. You go chop a bee, you no go chop. Huh? Good guy. Why are you enjoying this thing? Enjoying what? Mm. Look, we're not supposed to be having this conversation after this call we just had with this guy. My guy, anything that will lift the mood, I'm doing it. You understand? Straight up. Oh, good luck, man. Where did you go? Hey, believe you. Where are you going? Enjoy your dates, guy. How are you going to get the money back? The moon came. I'll find a way. Hello, girls. Hold on. Yes. Where are you guys going to? Uh, we're going restaurant hunting. You know what? Maybe you should come with us. <laughs> come on, girls. You know I came to see my sister for a while. That is why I'm not dressed up, looking all gorgeous and dangerous like you girls. <laughs> so, you. what are you guys restaurant hunting for? Um, unique food. <laughs> Stop kidding. No, we are not. Hold on. Dressed up as if you're going to see a boyfriend. Never can tell. <laughs> Seriously, tell me now. Where are you guys going to? Maybe we'll just try one out, okay? Because yeah. we cannot finish all sure. their food. Mm -hmm. um, okay, um... Have you guys... You guys should try this new restaurant at GRA. It's not bad. Really? Mm -hmm. I've eaten there. Mm. Mm. It's who will hear that? <laughs> Can you stop with your question? What is it now? Mm -hmm. I asked a simple question. <laughs> oh, okay, okay, okay. With someone special. Ooh, Hilda has a lover. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get going. Maybe we would find a lover too. Okay. okay. Bye. Bye. Thank, Bye. You. Bye. 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 Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> Hi. Hello. Hi. Um, sorry to bother you ladies, but I think you ladies are really beautiful. Thank you. You're welcome. Um, oh yeah, this is my friend over here. What are you doing here? I'm kidding, I'm kidding, I'm kidding. He's an architect and I'm a business strategist, you know? So that's what we do. Okay. Um, I'm Nora. I run a small business and 
This is my sister, Lily. Lily, what do you do? I'm jobless. Okay, that's hard to believe, but if you don't want to tell us what you do, that's okay. We're not going to push it. Yeah? Um, okay, Nora, it's a beautiful name, by the way. Thanks. This is my card. I believe I could aid your business, you know, okay. if I get the opportunity. Okay. Here is my card, too. Oh, it's a beautiful card. It's very elegant. Thank you. Um, why don't you, why don't you give her your card, you know, Lily? Why? Business. I mean, she already said she's jobless, so there's no need. Besides, you already have um, Nora, right? Nora's card, so I'm sure that's enough. Well, I think one card is enough for today. All right, well, it was beautiful running into you ladies, both of you, very beautiful. It's a good omen for today, you know? All well, right. have a beautiful day, as beautiful as you are. You too. Let's go. What's she doing now? The truth is that she's jobless. Yeah, you just said the girl the form with you. Is this the first time you've met a girl that's formal? The truth is that she's jobless. How can you just say that like that, bro? Yeah, well, yeah, don't have your time. You're crazy with this guy. <laughs> ah. Why are you always like this? Like how? Like how you were with them. There is nothing wrong with being nice to guys. Guys that we know nothing about. How else are you going to know them if you don't even stand long enough to let them finish introducing themselves? Oh, please. I don't have that time. So now we're back in the house. What are we doing here? We are being safe. Listen, Lily. Not every guy is dangerous, okay? We shouldn't just be friends to our family friends. We should get to know people, loosen up a bit. That's all I'm saying. Maybe you should hold back a bit so you don't get hurt. Sometimes I don't understand you. Why are you acting like this now? Why are you acting like I'm forcing you to do something you don't want to do? Are you not? How am I forcing you? How is this forcing? No, explain this now. How am I forcing you? Bro, let's forget about what happened this evening, okay? What I'm trying to propose is a, is a way to, to pay back this um, silo's loan, whatever. Let's just deal with it once and for all. And your proposal is that we leave the country, we run away. We're not running. Hey, we're flying away. So if we fly away, we're not running away. We are not. Okay, we're just trying to solve the problem. We both have skills that are in demand in some European countries. Bro, <laughs> how long does that process take? Like two days, two hours, maybe two minutes. Maybe you enter from the airport, they give you $2 million just for showing sure off. Abby? Why are you joking with this? How thing? am I joking? I'm not joking. I'm t Bro, I'm telling you, the solution is that we stay in this town. Make Silo know that we're not running. We're in this town. And make him know that we are doing what we can to get his money back. That's what we do. That's the solution. What's... Huh? What's... Why are you... Like, I'm not making sense. I'm making sense. You know I'm making sense. Bro, don't be all the time, bro. If you're frowning and carrying this, this burden of this loan on your shoulders, bro, like, you'll be overwhelmed, though. And if you're overwhelmed, you won't be able to come up with a solution. Do you understand? You can't expect a drowning man to maintain composure. Maintain your composure. Don't drown in your emotions. Bro, it's the best solution I can think of right now. You know, it makes sense now. It's not a solution. It's actually a problem. It's going to compound the problem, which originally came from you, Sha. But I'm not going to blame you for the problem, even though it came from you. That's not what this conversation oh, so is about. So it's coming back to me now. No, no, no. That's like what... had it in your mind. But you long. started this and now you want to compound it. So no, calm down. I'm now... I thought you said we are in this together. We're in this together, but now you're not in the driving seat. You come to the passenger seat. Because when you are driving, we are hitting too many things. Now I'm driving. Do you understand? Yeah, so uh -huh. no. Whose fault is it? My brother. Listen, you're talking. Uh, all this talk that you're talking now is just draining me of the food I just ate. Now I'm hungry again. But why is it that every solution I try to come up with never makes sense? Because it don't make sense.
Hello. Hello. Hi. How you doing? Um, I met you and your sister yesterday. Oh. Hi. Hello. Thank you for picking up my call. I didn't know it was you. Sounds like if you knew it was me, you wouldn't have picked up. <laughs> I don't know. Well, thank you for picking up, though. How are you doing? I'm fine. How are you? I'm okay. You know, I just called to know if it's okay for me to call you, you know, soon. It's fine. Yeah, so around this time is good for future purposes? It's okay. If it's pretty much any time other than too early in the morning or too late at night. Sure, yeah. Um, hey, it was great meeting you, okay? Same here. All right, bye. Bye. Come here again. So where, where should I go to? Where better go? I just get small need now. Now I can see her. How far she did? Is that why you came all the way here to see her? No, I forgot space. Ben, Ben, you know sister is still mad at you, right? You know. I know, but I'm doing everything possible to fix the reason why she's mad at me. Ah, uh -uh. you should have waited. You should have waited. Then you can, you can fix all of this later. I beg. Warn yourself. Respect yourself. I know, I know, I know, dear, this your, 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 your. Ben, what are you doing here? Ah, sister. What are you doing here? I asked him. Oh, sister, calm down now. I am not. Calm down. Shut up. Get out. See, calm down. Get out, Ben. Uh, get out. Get out. Are you serious? Two ben, minutes. Maggie Faye, I swear. Maggie Faye, even now that our people will not recognize you, they will hear what I have done and they will cover their ears. Mba, ona, out. Look, also what? See, out, Ben. Please go. Please, just go. I just need two minutes of ben, your time. Ben, make it fair, oh. You know what? See Ben now. Nah. Out. Oma, follow me. Ben, in now, now, please. I am counting. Well, in that case, person go die. Person go die. Then I kill you now. Money I don't get. Sister I don't get. Family I don't get. Where I want go? I'm not going anywhere. If he's die, we die here. Die and I die. The only ones they die. Alright, you go. How about? Wait. Here. Small two weapons, you don't just come ask for now, you're going to behave as if I am the only brother here. Honey, you called? Yes, I heard your voice. Is he not this person? I've been warning him never to step his foot into this house again. But this boy will have the effrontery to come here at any time. I want him out. So what did he do this time to get you so upset? Honey, what didn't he do? This guy sold my land, squandered the money. Not only that, all the monies have been given to this boy. Will I call him boy man? He has finished it. He can't give account of anything. I'm very angry. No, no, no. Just take it easy. Take it easy. <sighs> What do we need? Come, Come in. in. Oh, all right. Auntie Susan. Sweetie, how are you? I'm fine. Is everything okay? Yes. Is he not this person? This guy is stressing me. Nora, please call Benson for me. Okay, then. Oh, don't do that. Don't call this guy. Leave this guy. Just send him away. Just send him away. Let me have peace. Come on. Come on. Send him away. 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 Come on. Come and sit here. Come and sit with me. Come on. <laughs> Come on, take it. It's okay. You know what? I'll give you the money for the land. Okay? Thank you. But I'm still very mad at you. Yes. It's all right, sweetheart. It's okay. <sighs> chief, chief. <laughs> chief, chief. Your boy is loyal. Mm -hmm. Trust me, chief. Very loyal to your ministry. See, I want to thank you for all you've been doing for me, for my family, the ones you keep doing and the ones you still do, Chief. <laughs> so, how are you? Oh, 
chief. Not like I am fine completely, but I know after now I'll be okay. Uh, but how are you doing, chief? Well, I'm getting better. Yeah, getting better. Wow. So tell me, what's what's happening? What's the problem? Chief, nothing, no. No, honestly, nothing. You know, as a man, you want to try your hands on some things, so I made a wrong calculation into this business and then the thing collapsed. Mm. Nothing really serious. So, like, how much did you lose? All the money I made from the land. Like, how much are we talking about now? Nothing really much, Chief. It's just 27 million naira. Yeah, and look, it's not like I've lost everything, you know? Yeah, I'm still making all effort to recover the whole money back. You know, and then I came to meet my sister to just give me some little raise, you know, to be able to stabilize and at, at least I am the nest of kin here. I'm the only man in the family. But, but you see, the truth is, you've stressed your sister too much. But Chief, what are siblings for? Eh? That's what siblings do. Yeah, but you must admit that she has really tried for you. Well, yeah. yeah. Uh, she gives you money now and then, and you keep losing them and coming back. Chief, let me assure you, I am just one inch like this, close to my world. Yes, just I have some business ongoing. Before you know it, boom, I'm there. Mm -hmm. I just need a little race to navigate through the process. Okay. You are a businessman, you know how these yeah, things yeah. work. So, like, how much are we talking about? Honey, that? please don't go there. Please, I can take every other thing with this. Sorry. Leave this guy. This guy is a useless guy. It's okay. It's this okay. is a money pit. You can't keep throwing away money on this guy. It's okay. It's work okay. him out of this place. Okay. That's all I want. Just work. Walk this Sweetheart, guy out of this right. place. It's all right, honey. Pick up, pick up, come It's okay. So, Ben, how much are we talking about? Oh, oh yes, Chief. Thank you. I, I know you're always on my side. You know, man to man, you understand how these things yeah, work? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Something in the neighborhood of uh, like 7.5. Look, but if you decide to raise it to 10 million, you know, God is blessed. You've always done this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, this is what I'm going to do. Um, Nora, no. Nora, make a uh, five million available for him. But anytime you want to come here, you must let Nora know. So that she will let you know if it is convenient or not. Okay? Chief, thank you so much. Look, not like the five million is enough for me. Yeah, I was thinking it can get up to ten, you know, but I told out on nine bad pass. I, I, I'll manage this one. <laughs> hey, that reminds me, Chief. You know, last week we have one unfinished business. Last week there was a hundred k. Now you remember the hundred k? Uh, it's okay. Uh, Nora will handle it. Too. Wow. <laughs> Nora, please. Chief. Okay. Nora. Thank you. Yes, sir. Take, take care. Nora, my lady. Nora, my lady. Five, five point one million. Nora. Thank you. 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 Hello. Hello. Hi. Thank you for picking my call. You called at exactly this time yesterday. Yes, I did. I just wanted to find out if this was my lucky time, and apparently it is. <laughs> How are you? I'm fine. How are you? I'm good. I'm good. I'm good. Uh, why don't you have lunch or dinner with me today? What do you think? Um, I don't think today is a good time. No, come on. There's this place I know. This restaurant I know is really, really nice, and I think you'll love it. Okay, so just give it a chance. All right, let me think about it. All right, all right, sure. All right, later then. Bye. What are you thinking about? Um, Felix called me. He said he wants to take me for lunch or dinner. Hmm. What's that? Sorry. 
you feeling anything? Um, I just a little around my wrist. That means we need to do this more often, just as Dr. Raleigh said. Oh. Sorry. If he wants me running, I'll definitely <laughs> give it to him. Look at him bragging. I mean, let me push you. Sorry. 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 Oh, Take it easy. Yeah. Ah. Sorry. Yeah. Thank you. No. My oh, darling. Thank you so much. Ah, thank you. Thank you. Oh. Why are you staring at me like that? If anything happens to me. Please, I don't want to hear that. No, but wait, let me finish. First. I don't want to hear it. Why are you doing this to me? Okay. okay. Why? Okay, okay. I'll stop. What? Can I say something else? Better. <laughs> I'm really glad the girls have you. I'm glad they have you too. They are good girls. You know that. Mm, yes, they are. Mm -hmm. And you've been wonderful to them. <laughs> Thank you. You're a wonderful father too. And you're wonderful to me. I'm getting better. <laughs> yes. That's my little girl. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Thanks. Oh, You'll be fine. Yeah. yeah. I feel better already. Thank God. Well, I cannot tell you now for using best love to me. But I'll be going tomorrow. Why do you want to pick me? I have my driver. All right, we are going to see to that. I'll call you in the morning. Mm -mm. I cannot tell her that. Desmond has to be the one to tell her himself. All right, bye. Hello. Hi. I thought that if I gave you this time, you won't be able to make it. Well, I'm a freelancer, like I told you, you know. So that gives me all the time in the world. All right, so what next? Um, your driver can follow us behind. All the way home? Yeah. Okay, let me get my things. One question, though. Um... Is your father the owner of this company? What? I mean, I have your business card, so I know your last name. And I know the person that owns this building and company has the same last name as you. Um, that would be my distant uncle. He doesn't even know I work here. Okay. All right, let me get my things. Yeah, sure. Where are you coming from? From work, obviously. What are you doing in my room? So how come you are not riding in your car? Lily, what is it? I couldn't reach you, so I called your driver. And he told me you're riding ahead of him. Yes? Felix came to pick me up. I knew it! He's a cool guy. That you do not know. And I'm trying to get to know him. Nora! Please, be careful. Lily, I have told you when trying to get to know people, it shouldn't be at your own convenience. You should put in the work. I am trying to do that right now. Look, all I'm saying is be careful. The idea of you hanging out with him by yourself doesn't sit well with me. All right, then come and hang with us. This one asked after you. Who's this one? The other guy. That one that was frowning that day. You were frowning too. Not interested. Please. Okay, fine. Then it will be two of them and I together. When they call you for ransom, be quick to respond. Are you joking with this? I am telling you that you have to be by your phone so when they kidnap me, you pick up. I don't understand. What don't you understand? 
She sent a message that Lily is coming. So? So? She's coming because of you. Which one is so? Why? Why? Because you've been asking after her now. I told Nona that you've been asking after her. But I didn't. You asked, you did, through me. Okay, you've been asking after her. That's what I told Nona. Okay? And so don't act like I'm supposed to convince you about this, bro. Don't, don't come off it, all. Go get yourself ready to be nice to her because you've been asking after her. Okay, I made a promise and I'm keeping my word. I'm keeping to my promise. This so one, asking me a question, why? So, <laughs> let me come and baby you into it. I should beg you to do it. To this guy. I'm sure I'm in my room. That's that. So, why? So, <laughs> see this one. So, so, listen. And you just be talking. Did I send you? My guy gets ready to be nice. Guy, what do you mean you're caught up with something? You don't want to initiate this thing in the first place. And you know I can't stand this other girl now. It's the mean of this. Guy, this is a setup. I don't like it at all. Hey, guy, they are here already. They come now, I beg. Oh, hi. Hey. Hi, Mara, how are you doing? I'm fine. You're looking good. Thank you. You don't look bad, sir. Hey. Um, where is Felix? I don't see him anywhere here. Oh yeah, he is, uh, he's caught in traffic or something. He's on his way. <laughs> really? Okay. This is how we treat ladies. He can't even be at least responsible. No, I told you, this is not a good duo. <laughs> Sorry. So, what would you like to have? Um, we would like to have the restaurant's best dish. My sister and I are tasting food for something. Lily here wants to open a new restaurant. Do you want to talk about it? No. Oops. Sorry. What's the big deal? If you're trying food in a restaurant because you want to start yours. Hmm. You can keep guessing. I'm not going to talk about it. Look, this kind of business is not what you hide. You're supposed to sample opinions so you can make informed decisions. <laughs> and the opinion I need is from you. Well, that's what if you're what's my opinion in the first place. Oh, guys, come on. No, leave him. He's salty. I can be salty too. Lily, stop it. He started it. Oh, I only started what you started the first day we met. Okay, fine. You know what? Do you both want me to leave the table for you so you can go ahead and be salty? Oh, no, please. Please. It's okay. I apologize, okay? Apology not accepted. Look, I wasn't apologizing to you. <laughs> you know what? Nora, just give me a minute, okay? Come in. Are you... Mm. What a beautiful date. This is your fault. We should have stayed home. Uh-huh. So she'll run it? Yes. Oh, great. Uh, did you get the website I sent you? I did. And... Desmond's work is really nice. Yeah, he's really, really, really good at his job, you know. You should get Lily to call him, you know, because he's a really good architect. He could help her with design the space, you know. And he's a very dedicated professional, so she would enjoy working with him, for sure. Well, I will, but I don't understand the tension between them. <laughs> They're the same kind of person, you know. They're Shakara too much. <laughs> <laughs> but hey, do you know what? They might end up being the best of friends, actually. I hope so. Yeah. Um, all right, so I have to do some work for a client. Um, call you tomorrow morning. All right. All right. Good night. So you told Felix about the restaurant. Desmond is asking us to sample the opinion of this restaurant before we put in money. And Felix is encouraging us to talk to so many other people. Oh. So tell me, based on the advice from Felix, what should I be doing now? Standing or sitting? Since you two have to now decide what we both do. Nobody's asking you not to take the money. You have access to that money as much as I have, okay? So if you don't want to listen to advice and work together, then it's fine. You can do whatever you want. 
But I'm telling you, you need to listen to Desmond and see his designs. I'm sure it's what you're going to love. Friendship maker. He's <laughs> the crazy. See this guy that I'm building you up here, like, 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 like uh, those buildings that you design. See, I'm building you up. He's very professional. You would enjoy working with him. You're here wasting your opportunity. Hmm. Architect. So this is the exact um, design we want, but I don't know how we're going to situate it in the space we have. So what's the size of your space? I don't know. You know, it would be difficult for me to give an advice on a design if I don't know the exact size of your space. Um, we can go see the space. Can we go tomorrow? Um, I'm actually busy this week, but if you would... <laughs> what? You know, I'm trying really hard for us to talk and agree because I don't want things to be awkward with my sister that pushed for this meeting. But all you've done is act like I need to beg you. You're very annoying. But what I was going to say was, I'm busy this week, but if I get a chance, anytime this week, I would call you. I'm trying to help your life by giving you a job that would pay you. So you creating time to see this space should not be left to chance. I, I don't know what is wrong with the youths of this space. You know, I'll call you. I know. There's no need to pretend. See this hand. If I ever call you, let it break. I've paid for the drinks. So, do you like him? Yes. Are you like falling in love with him? Please, calm down. Well, you seem excited about it now. Well, he's like someone I'm going to fall in love with. But, I still need to find out more. I spoke with his sister today. Wow, so cool! <laughs> <laughs> Lily, you walked out for me. Lily! Felix. You should know as a gentleman that you are, you should call her and apologize and make things right, bro. I shouldn't even it's like it's, it's a bad look on you that I'm trying to convince you to do this. You should be trying to convince me to calm down so that you want to do it so much that I should be holding you back, like hey, don't do it overdo. You know? This is not how gentlemen do. See, you're even wearing pajamas, like the, the official uniform of pajamas. It's nice, like an official gentleman. No? You want to yab me now because it's not yab, yeah, bro. It's just facts. You didn't hear the way she was talking. My brother, you should call this girl. Forget what's call, 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 call. Okay, if you say so. I say so. So this is the number, right? It's a number now. Because now, my friend, call this girl now. Which one is this a number? Is it not you that used to chat with her? What kind of question is that? This a number? No, it's not her number. It's it's a, it's, a, it's a alphabet. It's My okay. friend, don't disturb me. It's okay. Call this girl. I'll put it on speaker so you hear. No, put that for speaker. Anymore. Hello, who's this? Hi, this is Desmond. Which Desmond, please? Felix's friend. The one that walked out on you at the restaurant. Oh, you. What do you want? Well, I want to apologize for walking out on you. I shouldn't have done it no matter what. So why did you do it then? Well, that's because I feel like you hate me. I 
don't eat you. Oh, you're never warm to me. I mean, your sister is all warm and nice to my friend Felix, but you, you always frown at me. I am not my sister. And hate is such a strong word, I do not hate. Well, I, I call to apologize. And also to tell you that um, I'll be free on Tuesday next, next week to come see your place. This week is quite busy for me. Okay, that's fine. So just send me time and address on where to pick you up. Okay, good night. <laughs> I hope you're happy now. Ah, uh, better behave when you see her. You should tell her to behave herself too. I don't tell you behave, oh. Because not be to shout at me every time. You could just be shout. I'm not agree. a gentleman. Is she a gentle lady? What do you mean is she a gentle lady? You're the one that walked out. That was very disrespectful as she walked out. As I walk out. Wait, so you're going like that? Because of woman. Thank you so much, Hilda. You have been a source of help to us in this project. And your ideas have been just awesome. You're welcome. Come on. You're my sister. <laughs> so don't mention me. Thank you. Um, hello, Felix. <laughs> You're such a clown. I'm done from work. I worked really late. Yes. You see? Thank you. <laughs> so, are you feeling any pain? Uh, just my right ankle. Oh. And I really don't know why. Sorry. Uh, we need to yeah. tell Dr. Wally. Okay. But let's walk for some few minutes. Hmm? Okay. <laughs> you know, I can't wait for when you both will find your soulmates. <laughs> I gave you enough space to try and find yourselves first. And I can tell you, I'm so proud of what you have achieved. Uh -huh. I'm a very proud father. Thank you, Daddy. <laughs> when they asked me to look for more children, you know, especially a male child, you know, that uh, female children could not continue a lineage, mm -hmm. I told them, Omo oh, no no <laughs> <laughs> so, When my ancestors come calling, I will gladly answer because my soul has found peace. <laughs> Daddy, please quit talking about that. You've not come for our Mugwa now. I need you and Auntie Susan to come for my Mugwa. Yeah. And by the way, we need to have a father-daughter wedding dance. Ah. So please, <laughs> don't leave me any Yes, Daddy, you need to get healed fast. Okay, I'm working on it. <laughs> oh, I'm such a blessed man. We are blessed children too, <laughs> Daddy. <laughs> ah. Just a bit more. Uh, Just okay. a bit more. <laughs> okay, dear. <laughs> okay. Oh, sorry, yes, Daddy. I feel better already. <laughs> That's good. That's good. <laughs> uh, yeah. I think Auntie Susan is making that your favorite egusi soup today. <laughs> oh, I'm looking forward to that. I'm looking forward to that. Yeah. Auntie Susan takes good care of you, Daddy. She's okay, a lucky she's man. A special <laughs> gift for me. She's a okay, gift for me. Yes, easy. thank you, dear. Easy. Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Uh -huh. Yeah, that's are. my daddy. <laughs> <laughs> Why are you laughing like that now? <laughs> Wait, let me let me paint the picture now. Stop laughing now. Let me paint the picture now. <laughs> I'm just bringing out my brush and my uh, what do you call that? Thing? My palette. I haven't even started painting, and you're laughing already. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Wait, wait, wait. Imagine your sister, okay? Imagine your sister, Lily. <laughs> you, can't, you can't even imagine your sister in that situation. No! Wait, now! I'm telling you that. Listen, okay. So imagine the guy goes there. He stops in front of your sister. <laughs> I will send you a design by tomorrow. But it will be different from the picture you showed me. Can't I have that design? I really like it. You will struggle with parking space. The design you showed me is sitting on a 3,400 square meter plot of land. 
and the entirety of your own land is 3006. No parking space? No. Well, that won't work. This won't. Which is why I came up with a design that I think you would like. I will send it to you once I'm done with the sketch tomorrow. I need to clear something. What? I don't hate. Last week you said you feel like I hate you and that has stopped me since. It's no big deal, okay? If you say you do not hate me, then you do not hate me. It's a big deal to me. My late mom used to say that people might think I hate them because of the way I say things sometimes. And to think that, you know, someone will still say that about me now, it's just, it's hurtful. I may be too serious or too stiff, but I do not hate. Okay. I think I'm dwelling too much on this hate thing, but I just needed to make sure I'm not misunderstood. I'm sorry. I didn't know your mom is late. Yes, I'm okay. And you? I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Hey, listen, um, why don't you come over to mine for lunch or dinner, you know? Don't go quiet on me, okay? I mean, I could come over to yours, but I just think it's a good idea for us to get to know each other more, you know? Visit. What? Come to my place. I'm going to send you an address. Uh... Yeah, sure. Okay. Um, see you, see you, see you soon. All right. And Susan. Good morning. <laughs> Obi, how are you? I'm fine. I see you're taking in fresh air. Yes, dear. Join me. <laughs> okay, bring it out. I'm sure you want to tell me something, right? What is it? Wait, are you okay? Yes, I'm fine. Cool, so tell me. What is it? Um, Auntie, I have a male friend that is coming to the house to see me today. Hey, are you serious? This is fantastic. <laughs> this is the one, only, since I've known my daughter. This is a great news. So, talk to me. How long have you been seeing him? Mm, just a few weeks. Is that enough? For you to know you love him. And so I really like him. Wow. Like or love? Mm, I like him for now. Okay. <laughs> but I see a lot of happiness in this face. And your blush. <laughs> I, I can't believe this. Somebody has captured my daughter. Mm. <laughs> I'm happy for you, dear. Thank you. Okay. Okay. I look forward to meeting him. All right. Um, he'll be here this afternoon. Great. I'm all in. All right. Let me go and wait till he comes. Thank you, darling. Thank you, Auntie. Are you sure you want to sit here? Yes, I'm meeting him. You're no sure. man has ever come here to ask about him. You're sure. <laughs> What's going on here? Your father wants to meet your friend. <laughs> Until you told him. Sorry, I was so excited. Don't worry, I'll go easy on him. Daddy, please. <laughs> I do. Thank you, sir. Oh, come on, let him in. Come on. Hey. 
For me, day tomorrow. Okay, on a tentative budget. Yeah. Right. Thank you. Thank you. All right. So I'll see you. Huh? Oh, this is kind of this nice girl. What? <laughs> Mm, but he later became nice. Yeah. I think he likes you. I like him too. You know, he made me realize that I should actually ask you these questions. You know, to you know, make sure I know what I'm doing. What question is that? You know, uh, if you would like to start an official relationship with me, you know, the kind that gives me the right to call you my girlfriend, and you guys call me your boyfriend. How about that? I want that. Me too. was here for a long time talking to your dad. That's so why I see him. Hey, sis. Hey, sis. Hi, sister. really? <laughs> How far now? Yeah, I see. Something happened, though. Huh? What happened? Felix met your dad. What? Mm -hmm. He was here? Yes. Are you guys, like, official now? Well, I have feelings for him, but I've not told him yet. Congratulations. So, how was work today with Desmond? Meeting you for the ask her. Now, how was the argument with Desmond? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Ha ha, very funny. But sorry to disappoint you, we did not argue. In fact, we talked for a long time. So I told him mom is late, and it sounds like his mother is late as well. So, we talked. Hold on a minute. You mean you two are friends now? <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to have him tomorrow so we can discuss uh, a design for the space with a tentative budget. Uh -huh. Good. Anyway, dad was really nice to Felix after 
bombarding him with series of questions. This is a famous hot seat. I swear. <laughs> <It's laughs> serious hot seat. Oh my god. <laughs> you should know. So this is based off popular opinions from the restaurants we've tasted so far. Mm -hmm. But I want you guys to take a look at these comments and this one. Particularly this one. Yes. This one. Yes. Cool. You see, they all have good reviews. Yeah. So, this is the design. Oh, wow. Can I see? Okay. So, I came up with the extra two so you can have options to look at. Lily, what do you think? I don't know. I don't know. Don't confuse. <laughs> no, but um, they are all nice. Which one would you pick? This one. Yes. Why? Because it's very unique. And I did it specially for you. Okay. So let's go. Let's see if we can do this one. What's the police you're looking? Well, I also did an estimate yesterday about that, and uh, everything I calculated was amounting to say um, forty million. Forty million. Yeah. And the color of the spanner that you explained yesterday. Yes. I want this. Then do it. We're doing this. Can we start immediately? Yes, but I will have to finish up with the designs. Then we go from there. Okay. I have to run now. Okay. So see you ladies later. I mean, we've been working together, so we have to be friendly. Mm -hmm. be there friendly. are lots of architects for you to choose from. Really, Nora? After you forced him on me. I beg, I beg, come on here, come on here. Please, <laughs> if you don't like him, I know you'd have found yourself somebody else. I know you. See, the both of you and your eyes. I don't, I, I don't even know what to say. You have eyes. Like, the guy is fine. <laughs> Lily. <laughs> okay, but this is nice. Right. It sure yes. is. Oh, yeah. Come on, it's happening. It's happening. Guy, Alpha, what's up? Silo. What's up, bro? How are your seats? Yeah, come, come, just come sit down. Can talk as civilized adults, you know, <clears throat> as we're all mature. Oh, this month, forty million naira budget. Well, I'll say that's nice. It's project money. You, you said, did he hear what he said? Sorry? Did he just hear what he said? What did you say? <laughs> he said it's project money. Sorry, mm. what? Mm. He said it's project money. <laughs> I know. Well, I understand. It's project money. Yes. The gears, the project, of course, they uh, were. Well, good. Silo, as I was trying to tell you when, when you called. Shh. Swallow whatever you have to say to me. You told me the tech investment deal was a sure deal, didn't you? I showed my sister's land in my possession. Raised 35 million naira. Put it in your hands. He blew it away. 
That's because I trusted you guys. I mean, I, I, I see still not the hustle. Sir. I was going to say, first of all, selling your sister's land is not the smartest thing to do because it could go anyway. It's an investment. We don't know how it's going to go. But we have ways of getting this money back. And that's what we're doing. We're going about it the right way. Just give us time. I will pay you off. Hey, Felix, there is no other way of getting my money back. I already fashioned a way to recover my money. And I introduced you to those chaos. I mean, those kids are in money. I know what they are capable of. Their father gave them everything. All you needed to do was get them to fall in love with you. And, and, and you take any amount of money you want from their hands. And I'll recover my money. Since I connect you, give them. I they worry you now. I they poke nose into a business. That's because I wanted the both of you to build your relationship with them. Take your time, do that. Huh? Look, Silo. I'm not dating any one of them. Well, that's your business. Date them or don't date them. It's none of my business. There's 40 million Naira on the table already. Pick up that money, hand it over to me as fast as possible. And go far away. Otherwise, <laughs> I will unleash my police on you. And make a warn you. My police know they take bribe. Oh. They know what to do. Because you know why? Nobody takes Silo's money and bury it at nothing. Listen, Silo. There is no listening to anything. What are we talking about? I mean, why they argue with you? When they worry you? No, no, no. Hear him talk. Just to date one of those guests and, and, and I'll recover my money. That's all. At least Felix here has, has started. He has one of the guests to himself already. Uh. That reminds me. The earlier you start taking money from her, the better for us. Okay? Sir, the thing is that you told us about the ladies, but we thought that they were like business oriented, you know? Like they were inclined to do business with us, get paid off of the business, and then pay you from the money we make from the business, okay? Not dupe them. That's not the right thing to do. That's huh? just not right. That's just not right. It's not <laughs> what you do. Uh, the good boy Felix. Good, nice, hot Felix. It's not about being a good boy. It's about doing what's right as opposed to what's wrong. Doing what's right is simply following my instructions. Look, let me one. I don't want to collect my money in peace me. I need my bulk money. You can get your money, sir. I'm telling you, you get everything, okay? But we just pay you in, in installments, in a couple of installments, and you get your money back. That's all I'm saying. Oh, you, you didn't hear what I said. Yeah, no, we could pay you, you know, if you give us a year. I mean, some people will say two years, but if you give us a year, that'll be okay. We pay you in installments. Hey! Man. But I told you guys that I was going to supply all the information you need. I'll put all the magic in place so we can pick up the millions we need to settle ourselves and be comfortable. Have I done anything wrong by that? Absolutely no. But you know what? You want it the other way around. And since boys want to play, we will play. See those two girls? Ah, uh, they are beautiful, right? <laughs> they are beautiful. But keep your eyes far from them. Mm, very far from them. 
You have 72 hours to get my money into my hands. Sir, it's not, we, we can get your money into your Felix! Hands. Sir, no, no, I'm not saying that, you know, I'm, you know, you had faith in, in the idea. It's great, but you have to give us a little bit of time, you know, because investments could go up or down. That's all we're saying. Since you want it that way, let's have it. I'm very sure, Felix, you know who you're dealing with. Silo. <laughs> you wouldn't want me to visit your sister and her family. That we know. And as for you, Desmond. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> your father is still mourning his late wife, your mother. And you don't want me to increase that pain. If he needs all the money, I doubt that. I mean, he's not going to buy all the materials in one day now. I mean, what if he wants all the payment at once? Then I'll give him. Why are you asking? Well, I know how you feel about him, and I know you like him, and I think he's going to be your boyfriend. I beg, leave me alone. <laughs> you are in love. <laughs> okay, I'm done with this. Let me say no. Make him ask for all the money. Yes, make him ask for the 40 million naira. She's going to pay. Yes. What are you talking about? Um, sis, just one of my friends. Which of your friends? My girlfriend. Yeah. Mm -hmm. We're just chatting about something. Bring her good meat. Let's make some. Oh, okay. So, um, I will send you everything you need, but then I, I don't want you to send me any money. You don't need any money? No, I don't. Uh, oh, I was discussing with someone I thought to find out what you need, you know, for part payment or something. N nothing, nothing. And I, I will call you back later, okay? I have to go do something now. All right. chance to argue with this guy the first time he told us to do this thing. To what end? He was insistent on it. Okay, yeah, we, were, we too we could have insisted. We would have told him to give us more time to pay this thing off by our own self. Okay, without getting to hurt someone. You think I got close to the girls to hurt them? Is that what you think? I know you're not that type of person. I was excited to meet them, okay? Because I'm a fan of their father. He inspires me a lot. I know that. I mean, I didn't think they were going to be into us or that they were going to be fun or level-headed, you know? I thought best case scenario would do some business with them, make some serious money, you know? That's why I was pushing for you to work with Lily. I know all these things, okay? But we need a solution right now. We need a solution now. So stop telling me things I already know. I didn't know working with Lily was going to be this fun. There's a whole lot we can do with them, okay? Let's, let's give them more value, make some money, and pay off this loan. Please, what are we going to do now? Hello? 
Hi, baby. Hey, hey, how are you? What's wrong? You sound off. Uh, there's just, there's something I'm trying to take care of. Can we sit today? I miss you. Hello? Uh, no, we can't see today. Why? I can't tell you. What is wrong? Can I see your father? Why? I need to reintroduce myself, okay? Please. I mean, just call me back if it's possible. Okay, what do you want? Hello? Last time I was here, you asked me lots of questions, and in answering some of those questions, I lied because um, I didn't know how to explain certain things to you. But you do now. Yes, sir. I'm listening. Um, right before we met Nora and Lily, uh, we had a bad business deal with a friend of ours that lended us 35 million naira. Um, so we we're begging him to give us more time to come up with the money to repay him. Uh, but he came up to us with what he termed a solution. He said we should make friends with your bosses and we get the money. What? Yeah. Um, I, I guess he had inside information, you know, which he guided us with. From this house? I believe so, sir. Um, the goal was to make your daughters fall for us and then we milk them. So why are you telling us this now? Because we don't want to dupe your daughters, sir. And I dishonored you when I came in here the other time and I lied to your face. Um, we don't do a lot of interviews, but there's some information out there about how you made your money and that inspires me a lot. Um, also, we told you so you could fish out whoever it is that's selling information about your family. How do I trap this person? I actually have no idea, sir, but um, I mean, every interaction with him, we use his alias, you know, and every transaction was done with a mutual friend. He didn't pay us directly, so we wouldn't know his name. Um, and for the years we've known him, we just called him by his alias, you know, his nickname. Which is? Um, Silo. That's the name he used to answer during his university days on the streets. I warned him never to answer that name before me. That was why you never knew him with that. Silo is Ben. I know what you're thinking, though I don't blame you. What? what are you doing? I'm ashamed of myself. I don't ever want you to look at me with distrust. I have no hand in this at all. So you want to leave me? What do you want me to do? My old brother to be my daughter's. What do you want me to do? Oh. But you had nothing to do with it. Uh, listen, Suzanne. Uh, listen, I'm going to deal with that idiot. I mean, how could you think that whatever Ben does has anything to do with the way I look at you? You are my wife, for God's sake. And I can't stand to lose you. So why would you think of ever leaving me? I'm so disappointed in myself. Suzanne. You had nothing to do with this. You see, you don't even trust me again. Why? I'm no more your little girl. I'm not Susan. No, you will forever be my little girl. It's okay. Hey, no. Listen, I don't want to ever lose you. I just need to find out who has been feeding him with information. Make him ask for all the money. Yes, make him ask for the 40 million naira. She's going to pay. Yes. Why talking? Oh. Yes. 
Um, sister, I just want to see a friend. Who were you talking to in the kitchen concerning money? Who was that? I... I think I was talking to my friend. <laughs> you were talking to Ben, right? You were talking to Ben. Sis, he needed my help. So dupe Lily and Nora? I'm asking you. Sis, since you came to this house, you told us your husband left everything to his children and left you with nothing. Ben and I were trying to get some money too. Jesus Christ, listen to me. I came to the house and I told you and Ben never to ask me for money. That my husband left all his businesses to his children. How does that concern you? Did I tell you to come here and make money for me? Sis, Here's, I'm asking you. Sis, you like to take everything that is thrown at you. Ben and I couldn't take it. How can there be so much money in this house and you're left with nothing? If my husband left his businesses with his children, how does he concern you? Does that mean I'm left with nothing? You and Ben called me to come to my house and help me. What did you do? You started getting information about my children to Ben, to took them. How could you do this? What have I done to deserve this, Hilda? I can't believe this wickedness. I can't. Listen. Useless girl. And wait, wait. I am not done with you yet. Are you looking into my eyes? Don't you ever. I don't want you people to step foot into this house again. Dojo, what madness is this? I can't believe these people. Oh yeah, out. Hilda, we took you as a sister. Why would you do this? Oh, please, please. I am not my sister. Neither am I your sister. See, I can understand if you don't trust me again. They are my siblings and what you have done is so terrible. Really, I am so ashamed. Auntie, it's fine. Okay? You've done nothing to me if you were untrustworthy to us. Thank you. Thank you, my children. Can I talk to Dad? Please do. I plead with you, please. Yes, it's okay. Thank you. Any moment from now, any fight he brings, we are going to have to take it back to him. Yes. Wait, hold on. It's, it's like it's here. I'll call you back. Or you just come home quick, okay? Sister. Silo has been picked up by the police. He pissed off my dad and will be punished for it. Seriously? Yes. We'll be coming after you guys. Oh. That's nice. Hmm. Is that why you refuse to take any money from me? Yes. How broke are you? What? How broke are you? Maybe I'm... Uh... I'm down to my last 30 key. I've not done any job in recent time. What do you hate about me? Nothing. Yeah, it's funny, because I, I actually like you now more than the first time we met. Me too. So, do you have a boyfriend? A lingering ex or someone that thinks he's in love with you? No. You? No. Do you want to? Yes. Me too. So, um, do I, do I qualify as a boyfriend? No. That depends on how you ask me. You know, you... I left your house heartbroken. And when we walked out, your, your sister ran after Felix, but you didn't come after me. She had a reason and I did it. So... Will you be my, my girlfriend? Well... 
what took you so long? Let's just say I'm... Let's just say I'm a gentle lover. And I like to take things slow. Yes, I think go. What are you doing here? I had to see you. Okay, you weren't picking up my calls. Oh, you think this is the best thing you could do? Nora, I love you. Okay? And I'm not throwing this love away for anything. I'm ready to take whatever your dad throws at me. Okay, but I'm not leaving you. I love you. I love you too. I'm ready to ride this wave with you. Young man, I don't want you keeping my daughter up standing for too long. Why don't you come inside for a drink? Come on. Thank you, sir. 